Hi, my name is Nicholas and I'm going to show you a quick tour around dataloader.io. Here we are at the homepage, so let's log in to dataloader.io using our Salesforce credentials. You just go and click on Login with Salesforce on the top right corner. I will select my environment. In my case, it's the Sandbox instance from Salesforce. And I have the option to use a custom Salesforce domain if I have to. In my case, I will just choose Sandbox. I will log in. And I will just enter my Salesforce credentials. Okay, here we are at the Getting Started page. Here I have access to this video overview, to the documentation, to solutions, and Microsoft information. I can also access this page anytime I want from the user menu on the top right. With Data Loader, we can do mainly three operations in Salesforce. So for that, I will just go to New Task, and we can do Import, Export, and Delete. Import means uploading data from a CSV to Salesforce. Export means exporting data from Salesforce to CSV, and delete means using a CSV file to delete information in Salesforce. I can also go to the settings page to configure my user profile, get the stats of how many task runs I have and how many rows I process using data loader. I can also set up my default date format and time zone and manage my connections. All my connections can be managed from here. So if I want, I can add Salesforce, Box, FTP, and Dropbox connections from this place. Creating a new task is as simple as going to New Task and select Import, Export, or Delete. I will just do a quick export. You will find um, the details for the export in a separate video, but I will just show you how easy it is. Just select the object, select the fields you want to export. You can add filters or write your own SQL query and then just save and run. So every time you create a task, it will be displayed here. Starting from now, this page will be your default page the next time you log in. On the right-hand side of the screen, we will find the history, where we can find the historic runs for the same task. And that's it. We successfully run an export. In order to download the results, you just have to click on the link, and it will download a CSV file with all the results. That's it for the overview. Thank you for watching and keep visiting us at www.dayloader.io. Thank you.